I don't know where you are in, in traffic, but I'm gonna give you the short answer um, from my perspective, Chance. Um, as the CEO of my companies, I have my number one, uh, number one goal or target or objective or responsibility is make sure that we are positioned to generate revenue. So as I, as I set the revenue target for the court, for the year, for the quarter and for the month, I'm making sure that there are strategies in place to hit those targets. And then we're having weekly follow-up calls with the team or myself if I need to, to make sure that I am on pace every single week. So if I say I'm trying to do 25 grand this week, I have my strategies lined up for the week that I'm going to do. And then I am um, initiating those strategies. I'm, I'm watching the analytics from those strategies, seeing what worked, what didn't work. And then I'm at the end of my week, after I look at everything, I'm making adjustments on what worked, what didn't work. And I keep that going until I hit my number. I think the challenge for a lot of us is we'll start something, but you don't, you don't see it through. I don't want to say don't finish it. Yet. You don't see it through. We go to the next shiny thing and then we get distracted. So Chance, if you say, yo, I got a product, I'm about to launch it. Set targets for it. How many, how many sales do we want to have? How many new people do you want to add to your list? Right? How much attention do you want to get? Create the structure, the strategy, and the system to hit those targets. And then once a week, you measure what you did. That's the part of the business that don't nobody show you, like in between the, the Rolls Royces and all the cars and the beach life is the back end actual work. I hope that helped, Champ.